Trading positions, um, this is uh, not only the retail uh, clients, but also uh, bankers and institutions. So it's a mix of uh, okay. smart and uh, perhaps not so smart money. We won't say which is which. Uh, to, to it's a total about. market view. A total Zach. market view. So yes. uh, people are still uh, long of uh, the euro, long of cable and long of dollar yen so sort of I mean you can sort of, you can see that on the charts really we're just all all these crosses were at uh, mm. support recent support levels or we've broken back up again uh, dollar cad short uh, which uh, is a seems to be quite a good idea given that it's fallen like a knife uh, yeah. since the BOC made their move yesterday uh, a bit painful on the Aussie dollar which is um, shot higher I think we're around uh, 7700 now in fact uh, yeah yeah uh, on that cross so uh, that's uh, Flying away against uh, expectations, 77.33 at the moment, and then euro sterling uh, long of that, uh, but that has actually uh, that that came back very sharply from the uh, from just um, below the 90 um, area uh, a couple of days ago. So that's mm. uh, so it looks looked like a bit of a, a bull trap uh, on that particular market. I think 89.50 was the peak, and uh, we're already back at 88.24, which is around the support area of the last 24 hours. We'll see whether that holds, but it looks a bit like a bit of a head and shoulders formation on that uh, chart.